Katie and Jenny Eclair, back on our screens next week, presenting a brand new show. It's all about art, combined with taking your clothes off. Well, Jenny joins me now, and Jenny, all done in the best possible taste, of course. Well, it is. It's, you know, it, 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 people do take some clothes off, but they don't take everything. There's nothing to frighten the horses here because <laughs> there are rules. It's daytime television. It's 5.30 Channel 4 every day. I'm so excited, Lorraine. I love this show so much. I mean, we did make it under extraordinary circumstances uh, in November. And um, it's such good fun. It really is that we've had so many laughs. And the, the, everyone, it's all about the contestants, really. I mean, I, I'd rather it was all about me, but it's... <laughs> is all about the contestants and how how joyful they are and how uh, Diana Alley is the resident art guru. I mean, I stick my nose in where it's not really wanted all the time, but uh, she's the real helping hand. And just seeing people progress over the week and trying stuff they've never tried before. And they come in and say, I only do pencil, I don't do color, I don't do this and I don't do that. Three days later, they're, they're doing everything they said they wouldn't. Look, you see, people are using color. And it was just... Oh, it was a joy to do, it really was. And they seem really, really lovely people. And also, so many of us now are trying new hobbies, aren't we, Jenny? We're trying things like, you know, because we can all draw a wee bit and it doesn't actually matter what it's like in the end of the day. But I think we're all trying yeah. these things. Well, I, you know, I'm a big believer in art as therapy. I've been uh, painting and drawing for the last few years. And, you know, I do online classes. And, and when, when we're allowed out, when we're all fully jabbed, you know, it's one of the things I, I look forward to the most, sharing an art studio with other people. Um, and I, uh, as you can see, my boiler door behind me, that hand, oh, I'd make a very bad weather girl, <laughs> but see the flowers on, yeah, 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 yeah. on that door. Yeah. I did that. It's wow. decoupage. It's, it's really good. Yes, yes. Yes, I know. It's not my painting. I'm not that good. But I do dabble. I yeah. do find it's the one thing that uh, makes my blood pressure drop a bit. And uh, you can't live by jigsaws alone during lockdown, you know. And I, I just think that this is a great opportunity for amateur painters. I mean, we're not pretending that these are, you know, going to be sold in the posh galleries down Cork Street. They're not. Well, I don't know, actually. <laughs> there's, there's some huge charm that comes across. Yeah. And I think that sometimes the amateur artist has something professional artist has lost along the way. Ah, that's a really, really good point. And you're right about things being charming. It's very, yes. very underrated. And there is a there yeah. is a real joy about this show, which I really, I, I really loved. You know, it just you, you got so absorbed. It's like a well, little bit when you're, you know, you're saying art is therapy. You get so yeah. absorbed in it that you forget about everything else that's going on, and that's good for the soul. And you're making presents for all your family <laughs> every time you draw. I mean, my family wince every time it's their birthday or Christmas. They all go, oh, God, what's she going to give us? What's she going to give us? Oh, no. Uh, but, you know, <laughs> I sort of, I, yeah, I it just, it, I, I genuinely think that we've got to get over ourselves as well and stop being so self-critical and, you know, uh, not so judgmental of everything we do. And if it is really awful and you really hate it, you know, put it in the bin. There's yeah. always another piece of paper. I use packaging, uh, you know, everything. I know that a lot of people in the past year have, you know, their incomes have collapsed. I mean, God knows my industry is, is, is in dire straits. Mm. So, you know, I use any bit of packaging that comes through the door, I tear it apart and I use that. That's a great idea. What a brilliant, what Aren't a brilliant way to... You are so you know, clever. You are so clever. When you so said you, your, your pick of the TV week, week I, I mean, it does look really good, that programme you picked out, Lorraine, but a little bit of my heart thought, she's going to say draws off. She's going to say draws off on should Channel have. 4. That was shameful. I should have actually. I stand corrected. I stand corrected. Now, look, you said obviously your industry badly, badly affected, of course, yes. but fingers crossed you might be able to go out on tour later in the year, perhaps? Yes, I have my tour, which was uh, titled 60, uh, open brackets, a little swear thing in the middle. I won't mention it now. I'm being on my best behaviour. It's very early in the morning. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and um, I'm hoping to go out in September with 60. Uh, I will be 61, but, you know, who's counting? It's rude to count. Um, <laughs> I'm not changing the poster because it's one of the best photographs of me I've ever had done in my life. My <laughs> hair looks great. Uh, so that will be uh, the postponed show. Hopefully, you know, I, I mean, in some respects, 
my audience, my demographic is mostly my age. So I'm fingers crossed everyone will be jabbed, double jabbed yeah. by September. Oh, I when think I so. Definitely. Off. The way it's oh, going. the Queen can come. The Queen is very welcome because she definitely will be double jabbed. Oh, she will. Oh, absolutely. Of course she will. Yes. And you know what, Jenny? Inevitably, there has to be a celebrity version of Drawers Off. It has to happen. And, um, you know, I'm up for it. I think it'd be great. Oh, fun. well, I hope so. Yeah. Well, I think you, you would me. look. I mean, nobody. We don't want anybody to be dragged kicking and screaming to the podium uh, and forced to strip. That's not what the show's about. The show's about making people feel very comfortable. Absolutely. Uh, with very little on. Um, but you know, with modesty protected. I mean, we're working with people who come from backgrounds where you know you aren't allowed to just sort of flaunt. So we are, you know, there's a sensitivity to it all. Of and, you know, as people get older, some people get really sort of uptight about these things. I've always been a bit of a flaunter myself. I'm not that fast, <laughs> you know what I mean? And I've done life modelling, so I know what it's like to be both sides of the canvas. Exactly. Well, I think it's, it is a wonderful show. It's a feel-good show. Drawers Off starts Monday, 5.30 on Channel 4. Jenny, always a joy. Good luck with it. It's so lovely to see you. You look wonderful. Oh, so do you. So do you. And... and Fingers crossed one day we can actually see each other properly, but thank you very much. Great to see you. Don't forget, you can watch full episodes of Lorraine on the ITV Hub and all the best clips, compilations and playlists right here on our channel. Just subscribe now and you'll never miss an upload. Click here to watch another video similar to this one or click here to head to our channel's homepage to explore all of our exciting videos.